simply start with a couple of questions. So the Connect 3D scanning, how yeah. exactly is that done, just like a general overlay description? So um, we're really just using um, standard commercially available Connect sensors on a completely standard Intel-based Windows 8 PC. Um, and uh, recently we announced an update to the Connect SDK, which includes a little applet called um, Connect Fusion. Um, and that's able to take the input from the Connect scanner and effectively in real time assemble a 3D image of uh, more or less any object. Um, so we really just thought it would be a bit fun to show people you know, the capabilities of Windows 8 and kind of standard off the shelf technology really. Um, and get people scanned and then you know to kind of demonstrate the power of it we hooked up to a 3d printer and we're outputting a few people yeah um has there been any other applications for this technology since the fusion update came out so the fusion update literally was kind of the week before we came to the show which is just okay. an update to the sdk i mean there's an awful lot of people outside of microsoft who are now using that sdk to just do some you know really cool bits and pieces um, you know whether it be medical applications uh, there's been quite a lot in terms of uh, retail and exhibition sort of usage, people just doing sort of cool innovative form factors because it's that kind of ability to interact with technology with our, you know, our bodies and, and voices and so forth. Yeah, and um, I guess one of the main questions would be, do you feel this is a new direction for Connect? I know it obviously came out as a gaming peripheral for the Xbox, but the technology behind it and the way that Microsoft adapted to it has made it a much more broader device in terms of what it can actually do in the capability. Um, would this be the new direction for Connect, or are we? No, I mean I wouldn't um, read anything into that because we brought it here to the show. I think really we wanted to just uh, you know connect with consumers, inspire them with what PC technology can do or what Microsoft technology can do, and show how Microsoft is really innovating. Um, you know the SDK was put out there because the community just loved what Connect gave them the opportunity to do you know as I'm sure you you know you saw people just started hacking it in the early days and so yeah. you know we said look you know time to start putting out an SDK to let people play with this properly um, you know overall at Microsoft we are big believers in you know the the new user experience new user interfaces uh, whether that be gesture control voice control touch uh, you know it's all very part of Windows 8 so who knows which way things will go in the future yeah and then um what, if there is any that you can talk to us about, are the future plans for Kinect in terms of if there are a next generation planned or is it? So uh, I don't think there's any public announcements on that. Um, not something I'm best positioned to speak to anyway, being in the Windows team rather than the Xbox yeah. team, uh, who are best to, to talk to you on that. But, yeah. uh, you know, as ever, we continue to innovate and drive our technologies forward. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Pleasure. Oh, my God, I'm <laughs>